Hi, so here we have a problem which was sent by Manish from India. And in this problem, we have to find the area of this shaded region where A, B, C, G and C, D, E, F, they are two squares. And the side of this square is 15 units and here each side of this square is 9 units. So to find the area of this shaded region, first we have to find the length GH. So we can find the length CH and then by subtracting CH from 15, I can find the length GH. So here triangle HCD and triangle ABD, both of them are similar triangles where this angle is equal to this angle is equal to 90 degrees and this is the common angle. That means third angle will also be equal. That means we can say the ratio of CD to BD will be equal to the ratio of CH to AB. And CD is equal to 9, BD is equal to 9 plus 15 that is 24 and CH we need to find and AB is again 15 and 3 3's are 9 and 3 eighths are 24 that means from here we can say CH is equal to 15 multiplied by 3 that is 45 divided by 8 right so if CH is this much that means GH will be equal to 15 minus 45 over 8 and this will be equal to 15 eighths are 120 minus 45 divided by 8 or you can say this will be equal to 75 divided by 8. So we have got CH is equal to 45 divided by 8 and we have got GH and this is equal to 75 divided by 8. And here if we see this triangle, triangle GIH and triangle GIA both of them have the same height which will be the length of perpendicular from point G to line AH and the ratio of their areas will be actually the ratio of their bases AI is to IH and that means we can say the ratio of the area of triangle GIH and triangle GIA will actually be equal to the ratio of their bases that is IH over IA and this line GB is actually the diagonal of the square AGCB that means this is the angle bisector of the angle AGC that means this is 45 degrees and this is also equal to 45 degrees and since this line GI is the angle bisector of the angle AGH in triangle AGH that means the ratio of IH and IA will actually be the ratio of GH and GA. So this will be equal to the ratio of GH and GA. Right? So here we have found the ratios of area of triangle GIH and triangle GIA. But we actually have to find this area. So if I draw a line from point H till let me call point P in such a way that this line HP is actually parallel to AG then this will be a rectangle and the area of this triangle triangle AHG is actually the half of the area of the rectangle. So the area of the rectangle APHG is actually equal to length which is 15 multiplied by the height or the breadth which is equal to GH and GH is equal to 75 over 8 and the area of triangle AHG will be half of this that will be equal to 15 multiplied by 75 divided by 16 and this is actually equal to the area of triangle GIH plus the area of triangle GIA and the ratio of the area of triangle GIH and triangle GHA will actually be equal to IH divided by AH which is equal to IH plus IA and this will also be equal to GH divided by AG plus GH that we can find from here. That means the area of triangle GIH divided by the area of triangle GHA and the area of triangle GHA is equal to 75 multiplied by 15 divided 16 and this will actually be equal to GH which is 
75 divided by 8 divided by AG plus GH. AG is 15 and GH is 75 divided by 8. So let's solve this. So from here area of triangle GIH will be equal to 75 divided by 8 multiplied by 15 multiplied by 8 is 120 and 120 plus 75 is 195 and this 8 will go in the numerator so 8 multiplied by this will go over here so this will be 75 multiplied by 15 divided by 16 so this 8 will cancel this 8 and 15 ones are 15 15 ones are 15 15 threes are 45 so this will actually be equal to 75 square that is 5625 divided by 13 multiplied by 16 that is 208 and this will be equal to 27 9 over 208 so this will be the area of this shaded region so that's all for this video and for many more interesting videos keep watching my smart subscribe to it and don't forget to press the notification bell because then only you'll get to know about my new upcoming videos so bye bye till then